When I was serving in the Diocese of York uh, with the now outgoing Archbishop, uh, Archbishop Sentamu, uh, at meetings and events that were held at Bishopthorpe Palace, uh, at 12 noon, everything stopped. A gong sounded throughout the palace and there was a pause for prayer, for intercession and for silence. It was amazingly impressive. And whether you were at meetings or social events, whatever it was, the whole uh, of the household, all the people who worked there stopped. And in this novena, nine days of prayer between Ascension Day and Pentecost, I invite you to do the same, to join me at midday each day, just to stop and to pray. Jesus taught us to pray, and one of the things he taught us in the prayer he left us was that powerful phrase, deliver us from evil. And I want us to pray, deliver us from evil, from the evils of the coronavirus, from the evils of fear and death, premature death, and from all the evils that hurt the world, injustice, the misuse of creation, the damage of relationships, deliver us from evil, but also positively with hope and excitement to pray, thy kingdom come. The kingdom which is the fullness of life and joy, which is the enjoyment of the beauty of creation, which this glorious summer weather is beginning to invite us to undertake. Deliver us from evil, thy kingdom come. We will be praying, of course, for the parishes each day in the diocese, but also we will be praying as a diocese for the whole of this nation and for the earth. Deliver us from evil, thy kingdom come. I hope you can join me at 12 noon each day from the Friday to the Saturday before Pentecost, nine days of prayer, just for a short time. Deliver us from evil, thy kingdom come. Amen.